We are going to learn about the Webster County Schools Early Childhood Initiative and the partnership with Audubon Area Head Start. If you all could please introduce yourselves. I'm Dr. Rachel Yarbrough, the superintendent for the Webster County Schools. I'm Peggy Grant, the Head Start Director for Audubon Area Community Services Head Start Program. Kim Saul Wester, Director of Early Childhood for Webster County Schools. Talk to us about the latest early childhood initiative in Webster County Schools. Webster County Schools is excited about uh, what's happening here in um, the area of early childhood education. Um, Webster County Schools historically has uh, been a school district that has had uh, successful preschool programs, but for the 15-16 school year, we will be expanding early childhood opportunities uh, for infants and toddlers and uh, three to five year olds um, in what we call an Alpha Academy. And the name Alpha Academy um, supports a philosophy in Webster County Schools around the fact that we really believe that great opportunities should exist um, to help students with a start, a strong start. Uh, the best beginning, if you will, of their school experience um, and that early learning starts when they're young. Um, and so we are really excited about the expansion of early childhood programs here in what we call Alpha Academy. Ottoman Area Head Start was very fortunate to start um, the program as a result of a grant that we received and so we thought of Webster County Schools uh, in two ways. One was there's a gap in infant and toddler care here in Webster County and we've been a partner with Webster County Schools for a very long time uh, in such a se successful partnership that we felt like that maybe we could fill this gap together and as a result we started talking about the things that Webster County Schools wanted, the things that Audubon Area Head Start wanted, and the goals that were in sync, and that then arose the Alpha Academy. I think the importance of this partnership with Alpha Academy between Webster County Schools and Audubon Area Head Start, uh, a key element of that, how that came about, was the communication that we have and how that came about in our contract meeting. Mm -hmm. That we didn't come to the table worried about a contract, we came to the table doing what's best for children and for the families of Webster County. And so I'm excited as the Early Childhood Director to have this opportunity uh, for families, for children, um, to expand and make a positive impact uh, that we can bring early. And um, I'm a philo my philosophy is that early intervention is the key. And I feel like with this opportunity of Alpha Academy, we will be able to reach that, um, that success. You know, the Alpha Academy in Webster County will, um, we will be able to afford an infant toddler program at Providence Elementary, two classrooms, and Seabury Elementary Schools um, in Webster County. And then at Seabury, we'll also be able to um, offer a full year, full day um, preschool opportunity um, for students that, and none of these programs existed prior to the beginning of the 15, 16 school year. And, and it's just been exciting um, that a simple preschool, um, Ottoman Area Head Start <laughs> contract with the Webster County Schools and that meeting that occurs in every school district every year, um, you know, when it's, when it's approached in a way that is much more collaborative, then it's amazing what opportunities can exist um, when you just really, really listen and, and try to figure out, can we create more opportunities for students than we currently offer? And in Webster County Schools, it's all about creating great opportunities for all kids. And we are always open to other possibilities that exist. So we're excited about the launch of Alpha Academy and that, that partnership 
that has been strengthened with um, infant and toddler initiatives and a full day, full year opportunity um, in our school district that's never existed before. One of the really great things that uh, happens when we talk to Webster County Schools is that there is such a mutual respect for each other in our contract meetings or in our communications just on a daily basis. And that is really, I think, the root of what led to just a great collaborative partnership. Um, the fact that we're able to, to look at things from our, each of our perspectives and come together and talk about how it looks and what it means <clears throat> to each other then, excuse me, then um, we can really work out any issues and, and problems that exist. And that's what we do on a daily basis. Thank you. Well, I was just going to say, I think it's very important for others that may be looking at building a positive working relationship between your school system and, a, and the agency such as Audubon Area Head Start is having strong leadership. Um, when you have a superintendent and a director that have open communication lines that are willing to talk through listen to other options to both sides of the, of the situation and willing to do always have what is best for children i think that's the key to the success and that will be the key to success for our alpha program and alpha academy is is because we want what is best for every child in webster county not just those that we've already had contact with but those that we may be able to reach that we had no idea that we could reach without having this opportunity in our school system for 15-16. I think um, as a school district and as, as leaders in a school district, um, sometimes we take for granted uh, partnerships that have existed. Um, you know, we've had a partnership with Audubon Area Head Start for years. And, and typically in most school districts, it has it has it has resulted in a successful uh, preschool program. We've talked about transportation. We've talked about meeting the needs of those um, preschool students to the maximum extent possible. But I think I think if schools and school leaders would approach any organization with a mindset that. Um, Perhaps if we listened a little more to, to what resources a partnering agency has to offer, and if we were willing to offer up anything we had on our side of the table to strengthen the partnership. In this case with the Alpha Academy, we basically say to Audubon Area Head Start, we are willing we are willing to pilot anything that's going to be great for kids and provide more opportunities for students. So Kim and myself, we come into the room saying that out loud. So then we begin to listen to you, Peggy, and, and what your team has to, um, what's out there that we really might not know anything about if we just don't say, ask that question initially. And I think, I think school districts perhaps um, have, have just kind of walked through partnership meetings or, or continue to just um, um, have programs kind of like, they, like they've always been in the same way, delivered pretty much um, under the same set of circumstances. And I think, I do think it requires a willingness to, to open the school district up to utilization of facilities, of school space, of sharing resources so that there's not a duplication, but, but what do we have to offer that might work with um, what Audubon Area is kind of looking for in terms of piloting a program or if there's a grant that's come, come through. And, and, and I do think it's that willingness to um, share and collaborate and listen and, and be open to opportunities for kids. You know, I think that, Rachel, you're exactly right. And what, what we come to the table with is 
um, knowing that we have some resources to, to provide. Uh, but we don't have enough resources to do what we really want to do. And that's why we really do seek other people out to actually be collaborative with because together we can maximize those resources. And we can accomplish so much more together than sure. we can separately. Um, the Alpha Academy came about really as um, thinking out of the box, really. Uh, and that's kind of what we do with our collaboration with Webster County Schools is, you know, it, it, the grant actually was um, written in such a way that it didn't include school districts. But after we got to talking about what we could possibly do, we figured out a way that we could include the school district um, to meet the needs of Webster County. And we know that because of our relationship with the school district that we will have a quality product when we get done and we get this launched and, and everything, everybody's going to be better off for it. The children are going to be better off. The families are going to be better off. The community's going to be better off. So it's a win all the way around. And so we really um, look to those partnerships and that collaboration in order to, to do the best for kids and the best for the community. That's great. We're excited about what is taking place in the area of early childhood in the Webster County Schools. And we could not do it alone. And um, it, it is going to be a great testimony to what can happen um, to enhance the lives of families and children in a rural school district when you maximize the partnerships that, that you currently have. Thanks for tuning in.